What's up, guys? Hope your day is going well so far. I'm out here, obviously, with the cows. We're in the back in the new pasture. I'm out filling the tanks, of course, as always. It actually looks like we're going to get some storms, which is great. I can hear the thunder in the distance. We've needed rain so bad. I'm sure you guys have as well. So Cardano's done a lot of things in this market cycle. You know, it's made huge step forward, huge advancements in terms of interoperability, in terms of scalability, okay? It's had stable coins introduced into the ecosystem. It's had improvements in the wallets, okay? It's tested itself out in multiple different sectors. NFTs, it's, it's been booming, right? Uh, meme coins, it's been growing. This is all great stuff. This is truly what you want to see. So it, it leads me to this. There's truly one last thing that Cardano needs to do to become one of these big dog chains out there. It needs to have adoption. It needs more daily active users. Okay, right now, I would say that for what Cardano is and what it's truly capable of, the adoption is very small. So the question then again lies, what brings us to that point? And truly what I think it is, is this market cycle. That may seem kind of weird, but what you have to remember is that Cardano is in fact a young chain. Okay, it's, it's essentially a baby at this time. Okay, it's gotten through this point. It's kind of learning learning the fundamentals, learning walking, you know, standing up on its own, hopefully stopping to suck its thumb. It's getting potty trained, right? And now it's at the point where it's truly learning. It's adopting. It's becoming its own person, right? Obviously babies, I know. <laughs> babies actually have personalities to begin with. I, I can say this. I actually have two kids myself. By the way, you guys didn't know this, but we're actually pregnant with our third due in September. Very, very exciting. Another boy on the way. That's very exciting. But it's been going through this, this growth phase. When we look at the Cardano chain itself throughout past market cycles, it's not what it was now. It did not have that same kind of functionality. Hell, you couldn't even build smart contracts before late 2021. Really what Cardano needs is just time in the marketplace in terms of the chain itself. Okay, I'm not talking about ADA, the coin. Obviously, ADA's been around for a long time. But I'm talking about true, fully functional Cardano has not been around during a bull market cycle. When we get into this bull market cycle and we start to see bigger adoption happening in crypto because we know mass adoption is coming, okay? It's, it's written on the wall. It happens every market cycle. You have huge increases in the amount of users in the networks. We're obviously seeing institutional money getting very interested in um, you know, blockchain at this time. We have businesses that are getting interested in utilizing blockchain technology. This is a big deal. This is the market cycle where you're gonna see what chains are going to thrive and which ones are not. Now we know that there are chains out there that still have some flaws, okay? We know that obviously, I, I, again, I hate talking bad about other chains, but we know that there are chains out there that have issues with security, that have issues with uptime. We know that there are ones that have issues with gas fees and scalability and network load and all this stuff. So right now, if the biggest issue that Cardano has is you know, users and adoption, that's an easy one to overcome. That's why you're starting to see some of these partnerships that I, I say are a lot bigger deals than they seem. You know, obviously the one with uh, World Championship Sports, I think that could lead to something something really, really big there. Um, and then obviously the big thing with Vodafone, you know, the, the NFT, utility-based NFT, that's a huge opportunity there. This is where you could truly see Cardano begin to emerge. You could see it go from, you know, this daily active user count of about 60,000 right now to hundreds of thousands, if not millions of daily active users. That's the kind of surge that I think this market cycle could truly br bring because again, it, it r really handles all these, uh, all these issues that other chains have. It's scalable, it can handle increased load, right? It's it got perfect uptime. It's got you know, great security. These, these are all the things that you look for. And when you have these other bigger entities coming in, that's what they're gonna look for too. So really all Cardano needs right now it's just some time. I need some time to get into my hose just fell out of the tank. Ah, dang it! I hate when this happens. See, this is this is why you always gotta watch your hose. Anyways, <laughs> and it's out again. Okay, I gotta deal with this. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Definitely show your support below. Hit that subscribe button. Give it some time. It's gonna take some time, but Cardano is going to get there. <laughs> I appreciate you. Have a great day. I hope to catch you in the next one.